There are about nine French-based players in the Ivory Coast squad. French League One has been a springboard for players from West Africa, including the likes of Didier Drogba and Yaya Torre. Recently, South Africa has been catching up in terms of exposing talent to this league. Lebohang Motiba, Bongani Zungu, Keegan Dolly and Lebohang Thiri are just some of those players. There's about nine French-based players in the Ivory Coast squad. And from the days of Didier Drogba, Yaya Toure, and many, many players from West Africa, French League One has always been a springboard for them in Europe. Recently, SA has been catching up in terms of exposing talent to this league. Motiba, Bongani Zungu, Keegan Dolly, and Lebohang Piri are just some of the names at this league. There's some players um, in Ivory Coast I used to play with and there's some also I played against them because you know some of them they play in League One and uh, especially Nicola Pepe I used to play with him at Lille so yeah there's some players that I know. One of the hottest talents in this Ivorian side that is going through a rebuilding phase is exciting winger Nicolas Pepe of Lille FC. Interestingly he played with Motiba before the Bafana striker made a big move to RC Strasbourg last season. I know him and I've uh, played like uh, a year with him and uh, I know his quality and that's what I've been, uh, you know, I'm going to tell um, the, the centre-backs and uh, where to be careful and uh, where to look at him. French leagues have got the biggest representation at this AFCON with 88 players with the South African PSL and NFD at second place with 47 in total. The influence of French football on the African continent goes beyond the football pitch. What is special about it? League One is a league that is a very um, intensity, you know, it's, they play with high intensity, uh, they're very aggressive and uh, uh, and look, as you said, there is a lot of uh, you know players in League One from Africa. You know, that's why League One is a very difficult league because they're very strong and uh, mentally, you know, focused, and uh, they're very um, aggressive when it comes to you know tackling players. So, for me, I think this uh, Afcon is going to be difficult. During the qualifiers, the combination of Motiba and Belgian-based Percy Tau started to develop into a deadly partnership up front. South Africans will be hoping that it hits all the right notes in this tournament. We, me and Percy, we talk a lot. We, uh, we always make uh, jokes and we communicate, um, even here at the hotel rooms and uh, even at training. So. Um, me and him up front, we um, very, uh, very, very good. We have a good uh, relationship, but it depends. Also uh, with Lars, also he has a good relationship with us. Me, Percy, and uh, other guys, he's very good in front of goals. Lars, he's very, very good. Bafana Bafana head coach Stuart Baxter is expected to stick to the tried and tested combinations in this opening game. But most importantly, he will also take Motiba's input seriously.